Hi everyone, welcome to Real Time Tips. This is the first in a new series of videos which will hopefully give you some information that will help you improve your video marketing efforts. For the first edition, we're going to look at how to stop your competitors' videos showing as suggested videos after your video is finished playing. The first thing to say is that unfortunately it's not possible to stop this happening on YouTube as they obviously want you to bounce around viewing different content and ultimately consuming more advertising. But it's not all bad news because if you as many people do embed videos from YouTube on your website then it is possible to stop these suggested videos from showing after yours is finished and it's actually really simple. So now we'll take a look at how to do it. When you click on the share option underneath your video and it opens up the video URL, if you look just below that you'll see the word embed. If you then select the embed option, what you'll then see is the code above it has changed and you've now got the code that you'll need to copy and paste into your content management system. Before you copy and paste this code, have a look at the options underneath it and you'll see the top one says show suggested videos when the video finishes. If you deselect this option, then these videos will not show after yours on your website. It's important to know what's happened here because some content management systems, WordPress for example, don't actually require you to copy the embed code and simply ask for the video URL instead. If this is the case, whenever you copy the URL, what that will do is use the default code that allows the suggested videos to still show. In order to stop this, you'll need to speak to your web developer about making the change to the code that will stop this happening. To help you out with this, we can take a look at what happens to that embed code whenever you deselect the show suggested videos option. So this is the default embed code, and this is the new code for when you deselect the show suggested videos option. And this is what has changed. A small bit of code has been added, as you can see in the screenshot. So once you've got the correct embed code, you can now copy and paste this into your content management system, safe in the knowledge that the suggested videos from your competitors will not show after your video is finished. So that's it for episode 1. Um, I hope you find those tips useful and you'll check in again for episode 2. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll include a link in the comments below and that'll keep you informed of all the latest episodes. And if you think anybody else would be interested in this video, please tag them in the comments below.